What's up everyone, it's your boy Norrenrad89 here bringing you another video and today it's just going to be a really quick video as we are going to go over my thoughts for the third film in Ty West's X trilogy. Yes, Maxine is coming out and we finally got the trailer. I'm so excited. Like This trailer just... Oh, I'm getting goosebumps already. I'm so excited to talk about this. So like I said, this is going to be a really quick video giving you my thoughts on the trailer. I will have the trailer link in the description below and all that jazz. So let's do this. Roll it. So, man, I am so excited for this. Like I said, and for me, just to so you know where I'm coming from, I am a huge supporter of Ty West. Ty West is one of my favorite directors in the game right now. And in terms of X and Pearl, I love both of them. X I like better than Pearl, but I both... I love both of them. And Maxine, the trailer just heightened my excitement. It looks fantastic. It takes place in 1985. The trailer has a fantastic trailer song. Mia Goth looks beautiful, absolutely gorgeous, and it looks like she is going to steal and chew up every scene that she is in. I've really, she's an actress that I can't understand and fathom in my mind why people don't like her. Like, she really is great like in terms of her delivery on screen the characters that she turns into and just her presence like Mia Goth is really a fantastic actress and I can't wait to see her chew up the scenery like in this movie like oh my god Maxine looks fantastic we have the uh, Night Stalker like that whole sequence where they're talking about the Night Stalker that's going around California and is terrorizing young girls and all this stuff and they're going missing and being killed and like oh man it just reaps like New York Ripper vibes or Zodiac vibes that's what it feels like it feels like a Zodiac movie or like New York Ripper and I'm so down for this you know what I mean like the deep seedy LA, you know what I mean? Like back lots of porn movies and doing freaking, you know, film and trying to break out as an actress and then like, you know, running into a, a killer that's going around killing people and then also running from your past. Like, you know, Maxine is running from something that happened in her past. We have Kevin Bacon in here as an inspector. Like there's just so much to love about this trailer. Like I said, I'm, I'm trying to reel in my excitement and reel it back so I don't just like ramble off. But yeah, there's everything about this trailer just made it more positive for me. And I was like, oh, this is right on my alley. And I'm thinking that this is going to be Ty West magnum opus. That's how I feel. The way this trailer went down is it makes me feel like this is going to be Ty West's magnum opus. This is going to be his best movie. The movie that he poured most of himself into. And him and Mia Goth just deliver, deliver. And I feel like that's going to be this movie for real. So I'm so excited for this. I am so excited, elated for this movie. And like I said, I think as it goes down, as it stands... This will probably be one of the greatest trilogies in horror history. We have the Fear Street trilogy. That's a fantastic trilogy, but there's not that many just straight up trilogies in horror anymore. Everybody keeps going for more and more sequels, and then we have prequels and requels and remakes. So there's really not that often that we just get up straight, straight up trilogies. It's not that often. And Fear Street is probably the most other recent one that I could remember, which is going to change because we're going to get other Fear Street movies, to be honest. So that's going to change as well. And I real, I hope Ty West keeps this. I hope Ty West keeps it X, Pearl, and Maxine. And that's it. And that's the three in this universe. I really do. And to also speak to the trailer, like the scene where you see Mia Goth, Maxine's character, walk up and she sees the, the Bates Motel and like the house and like the sign, like... Woo! I'm all for this, for real. This is a movie that I'm going to be there day one. I'm going to be in the seats there. And then, like, right after telling you all, like, I might do, a, like, an out-of-theater reaction video for this one or something, depending on, like, how excited and how I feel about this movie. So, yeah, this is one that I'm going to be there for, definitely. So let me know down in the comments down below. What are your feelings on Maxine? Are you excited for this film? Are you not? Are you just mediocre? Do you not care? Like, I'd love to hear from all of you down below all your thoughts. Please like this video. That definitely helps out the channel. Subscribe if you're new to the channel and have that notification bell poked so you're notified anytime I post a video, but most importantly, I want y'all to have a safe and happy day. Peace out.